you tell me what they did? Something that we're doing different this year in our chapel in the morning is bringing guys from the local church in as guest speakers a couple of days a week. And that is just to maybe add life to the stories that the students have already heard from the Bible and uh, to give some simple applications to that. Hi, my name is Miss Joy and I am the kindergarten teacher here at Grace Christian Academy. Something that um, attracted me to the urban setting was the mission opportunity and also being able to um, interact with kids after school. Um, one of my goals this year is be more intentional and also be more purposeful in the way I teach and the way I interact with the kids. My name is Ella and I'm in kindergarten. My favorite thing is to do art and school's the best thing ever and I like to come here so long. And my baby brother, I love him and I, I like playing with him and I love him so much. A mí me gusta la escuela porque es una escuela cristiana y le ayuda a nuestros niños a que puedan seguir el camino de Dios y es una bendición de Dios tener esta escuela aquí en la comunidad porque es diferente a las escuelas comunes allá les enseñan otras cosas que nosotros como cristianos no queremos que nuestros hijos oigan o aprendan y aquí esta escuela cristiana me gusta porque les ayudan a los niños a que puedan entender y saber más de Dios aunque uno como padre les enseñe en su casa pero también lo que ellos miran en las escuelas o lo que aprenden en las escuelas también a veces de parte buena o de parte mala les perjudica a ellos y es una bendición de Dios para mí tenerlo aquí en esta comunidad esta escuela cristiana what happened she asked Leo was hurt during the game dad told her alright somebody tell me what's going on Miss Starcher made the, the worst brownies. Why are they the worst brownies, Benny? Because he put way too much cocoa powder in And he and put uh, eggshell. And eggshell. Important question. Did he follow instructions? No. No. He did not. An object lesson by Mr. Harsler, his prize brownies. Got eggshells. Got way too much cocoa powder, way too much sugar. What you think? bad. Ooh, that's <laughs> <laughs> what do you think, Fanny? What you think? <laughs> Pretty good. Mm -hmm. Tell me what, what you think, Andreas. Eat it. Let's see. Mm. <laughs> good. <laughs> you love it. <laughs> What's up, Trouble? <laughs> I'm going sugar crash. <laughs> eat it, eat it, eat it. Did it? Did it? All right. Oh, not go. the whole thing. What if you don't Did like it? it? <laughs> Crunchy. <laughs> is it good? My name is Kaylee. I am 11 and I'm in sixth grade. The favorite thing about Grace Christian Academy is recess. I like cargo ball and cones. My favorite subject is math or maybe history, and I love reading. Okay, so how do I make that? 13 on 3. Okay. And then 37 on 7. My name is Erica, and this is my second year at Grace Christian Academy. I teach grades 5 and 6. One thing that excites me a lot this year is just seeing the growth in my students that I had last year. It's exciting when you see academic growth, but it's even more exciting when you see character changes and how they respond to me and they respond to their friends in a different way. And I wanna like make sure that they are affirmed in that, that they, I see their character growth and that ultimately that is the most important thing. Hi, I'm Kate from Grace Christian Academy. I am teaching first and second grade here. This is my second year teaching. One of my goals for this year was to, um, to teach them academically, but also to see beyond um, the like, behavior and what is driving them at school and maybe see um, 
and say like how to love them better. One of the highlights of just the school year so far is getting to see the kids every morning and they come in and they're like very sleepy faces, but they're always like, good morning. Just love to see like, they're so sweet and they're such fun kids. My name is Sammy and I'm seven years old and my favorite thing is in school is math to learn. Where are you going Andreas? I'm scared. <laughs> if you do it, I will let you keep a little bit of my hand. <laughs> Thank you. 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 Thank I am a second year teacher here at GCA and this year I'm teaching third and fourth grade. Last year I taught kindergarten and it's fun to see some of the differences between those age groups. So at the beginning of the year the students all came on in on kind of different levels of learning and one of my goals as their teacher is to meet each one where they're at and help them advance to the best of their ability. And that might not look the same for each student, and that's okay. But I want these students to know that even more than academics, they are valuable, and where they're at doesn't determine their value. Hi, my name is Savannah, and I'm 10 years old. I'm in sixth grade, and my favorite thing about school is recess and, like, and cones and Bible ball, and my favorite subject is math or history. Hi, my name is Brandon Zimmerman and uh, I'm teaching here at GCA. Uh, this is my first year teaching and um, one thing that attracted me specifically to the urban setting here, I feel like a step in my life, is learning how to disciple people. GCA um, is a small school. It allows us to disciple them very much more individually um, on an individual basis. And that's something that attracted me, I think, to GCA that because of wanting to know how to disciple and working, uh, just working closely with people. Um, a lot of it comes down to spending time with the people that you're discipling or the people that you're um, working with. Everyone has somebody that they're influencing um, and whether or not you're a teacher, a lot of that just takes a lot of time and energy and teaching I think is a good way to do that. Hi, I'm Devin. I'm the administrator here at Grace Christian Academy. And I want to thank you for your interest in the work here in Detroit at GCA. The porch we're standing on right now is part of the house that's been being worked on. It has been a, a long process. The last two years we've been working at permitting and work groups have come in. We want to thank all those work groups that have had a part in that. And uh, we are in the final steps of having some final inspections done. And uh, so we praise the Lord for the way he's provided and worked in that. After this project, we hope that our projects are finished for a while, but we are, the school is growing at such a uh, pace that we've turned down students every year. And so we're really praying about the possibility of expanding, uh, purchasing another building, um, what that looks like for adding on here. So pray with us in that. And something that we've really been praying about, there's a building on Larkin Street. And if you follow anything that happens here, maybe you've seen a poster asking for a prayer on Larkin Street. Um, the building was for sale and is no longer for sale at this point, uh, but the current owner possibly would be interested in selling it. And so we're really asking the Lord to guide us 
in, in what his plans are for GCA in the future. We appreciate you and appreciate your support. Thank you.